One weekend. Oh, wow! This is an incredible view! Yeah, it's pretty insane looking from up top. Let's see what Nico likes. I like sea urchin! Okay, here's your treat. My name is Moroboshi. I'm the leader of the world-renowned Moroboshi Financial, and my hobby is business. I'm a doctor and scientist as well. Right now, I'm having fun fishing maids. I'm so happy! Thank you, Mr. Moroboshi! Oh, I found a good sushi place the other day. We should go sometime, Moroboshi-chi! Huh? I'd love to go. It really is a nice place, isn't it? <laughs> All right. Excuse me! Two trout, please! My name is Tomoki Nishiyama. I'm an office employee who likes to go to different sushi places. Whew. Uh, give me the plum meal, please. Right away, sir. I'm so tired today. I worked hard. Here you go. Ooh, it looks so good! Thank you! I gotta really treat myself sometimes or I'll lose my mind. There are always people that come by like this and try to flex when they clearly don't have the money to be here. This place is too expensive for you, pal. You need to wait another century before you're ready. I was quietly enjoying my meal when some women who seemed to be in their 20s showed up. This is such an expensive place and it's so good, so I highly recommend it. Wow, it's so modern and fancy. You would know a good store, wouldn't you, Kokomi? They then sat next to me. Looks good, right? Huh? The loud girl Kokomi looked at me. Dude, why the hell are you here? You're in sweats. Go to McDonald's or something. This is not a store for people like you. Remember that. <laughs> Everyone thought it, but no one said it. Way to go, girl. <laughs> uh-huh. Amazing that you can say that to someone you've never seen before. How rude. I'm gonna order, so just let me know what you guys want. You're such a gentleman! Seriously, he's kind and good-looking. Hey, Daiki-kun, let's trade numbers. That's not fair, me too! Me too. Oh, I'm so tired. Jeez, there are so many messages. Sure, I'm free this weekend. Uh, I'm not gonna be able to call right now because I'm about to shower. Ah, uh, I'm over it. I can't handle this many women. What do I do? Hmm. Ah. La la la. We're not going out yet, but I'm definitely going to make him mine. What are these women doing here? Thanks for coming, guys. I had all of you come over today because I'm too popular. I'm going to find one woman out of all of you. What the hell? I might be able to be your girlfriend. Daiki kun pick me! Needless to say, I will be considering marriage with the girl I choose to date. So, I have a younger brother who is currently the CEO of West Mountain Co. And also potentially the next chief chairman of the company. I'm going to have that amazing brother help me. By the way, when he eventually becomes the chairman and I become the CEO, I will be supporting him. That means Daikikun will be the CEO one day? West Mountain is huge, that's insane! Hang on, Daikikun is nice, but the younger brother is definitely the better choice here. <laughs> I'm gonna enjoy the younger brother while everyone is fighting for Daiki. This is my younger brother, Tomoki. Ah, oh, he's so good looking over here! Hmm? That's that woman that was being horrible at the sushi place. Oh, this is awkward. I love you way more than I love Daiki-kun. She didn't know at all, and for some reason she kept giving me this weird look. And so the war began between the women. Tomioka-san, I'm really good at cooking. I've got over 100k followers on Monstagram. My house is the originating house of the Money Bonus style pottery. I think my background is very perfect for some of your stature. I'm from a very rich household in Monty Bay. I'm very rich. <laughs> that just means your parents are rich and you're just a girl. What, you just got 100k followers and you're acting like some kind of chef or something? <sighs> this isn't gonna work. Alright guys, uh, everyone calm down. I can tell you guys all have great talent and come from excellent backgrounds. 
But here's what I want from the woman whom my brother should be dating. Someone who will love my older brother from the bottom of her heart. I will go on a date with each and every one of you to see how passionate you are for him. Perfect! Time for me to get closer to Tomoki-san! I'm gonna make him fall for me. I will be performing the role of MC for the event. We're going to do this bachelor style. We moved locations and headed next to the pool at the resort. We were all going on a group date. Are you close with your brother? Yeah, I respect my brother very much for how social he is and how much of a gentleman he can be. I'm an only child, so I'm jealous of your relationship with your brother. Can you tell me about your childhood with him? Right around the time I finished talking to everyone, my brother brought me a single tulip. Alright, it's time for the first tulip ceremony. The woman who Tomoki has chosen will receive a tulip. The meaning of a tulip is loyal love. And just like a tulip, the flower will be presented to the women who are capable of pure and loyal love. Women who did not receive a tulip will unfortunately be going home. That's how we started shaving down the number of potential partners. And it was finally down to four remaining contestants. I'm gonna be chosen! I'm so happy, Minnie! I'm gonna be chosen! I'm going to be the last one! I can't believe I made it this far! We were starting our two-on-one -on -one dating with two partners. The first date will be with Umika and Ichiko-san. I'm gonna show you that I love Daiki-san more. Um, I'll do my best. It's so fun walking on the beach. Oh, hey, this shell is pretty. Huh, a Sakura shell. You don't normally see them in this good of a condition. Really? You know your shells. Bet you get burned on the beach. Why don't we go to a fancy cafe? I think I'm gonna keep enjoying this slow time. Ugh. I chose Umika-san because I felt like I was being healed around her. I gave her a tulip. Thank you so much! It was down to two contestants and we were on a one-on-one -on -one dating session. We will be starting the one-on-one -on -one dating, starting with Kokomi-san. I'm so happy to be here! Both Daiki and I love good food, so we will be judging a woman based on how much we enjoy eating with a girl. We chose an expensive French place of the date. The main course is meat, so uh, how about we start with some red wine? Sure! Then let's have 20-year-old money 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 tea. The wine is pretty expensive and actually really smooth, isn't it? You really know how to choose your wines. I love you more than him, so let's really get along, huh? I'm definitely gonna have a better time dating him than his brother. <laughs> Kokomi-san is really incredible! We talked about wine and fine dining before the date with Kokomi came to an end. Next up, we have Umika-san. Uh, I'll do my best! My parents own and operate West Mountain Co., which is a sporting goods store. We will be judging the contestant based on our passion for sports. First, we enjoyed jet skiing. <laughs> Hang on tight! Okay! It feels so good! That's good to know. Then we went paragliding. She was also having a lot of fun and enjoying herself with this. We're so high up, but the wind feels incredible! You seem so calm, but you really enjoy being active, huh? I've never done any of these, but I grew up in nature, so maybe that's why I love it. Humika-chan is definitely the more athletic of the two. I can't believe that it's our first time! Ugh. We finished up with Umika-san clearly having a great time with all the sports. Daiki will be the main decision maker in the next choice, and I will be helping him judge. We will now bring the potential girls to our house to meet our parents. What? It's not gonna be Tomoki-san anymore, huh? Unfortunate. But I don't think it can hurt to kiss Daiki-san's ass either. <laughs> First, we headed to Kokomi-san's parents' house. They lived in a nice little place in the city. Thank you both for coming today. I worked hard on cooking this for you too. Oh, you cooked this. Wow, thank you. Yeah, not bad. Kokomi is very devoted when she decides she wants to date someone. I think she will have no problem loving you, Mr. Daiki. Listen up, I'll be a wonderful wife! Let's head to Umika-san's house next. Her house was next to the ocean and full of nature. Wow, we've got the hillbilly bunch here. Wow, thank you for coming this far out. She's a little shy, but she's hardworking and a good girl. Please, take good care of her. Now, you will be meeting our parents. 
Here they are. I see, we're gonna see them without any warning. Wait, no, I'm not ready. Nice to meet you. I'm their father. And I'm their mother. You two are beautiful. Nice to meet you both. My name is Kokomi. Um, nice to meet you both. My name is Umika. I can tell you guys raised wonderful sons because you yourselves are full of wisdom and power that you can't see in regular people. <laughs> you think so? Thank you. Um, uh, what are your hobbies? I'm not letting you talk. <laughs> Aww. It's almost time. Do you both have any last words? I think I would like to learn from them to have a great relationship. Um, I always thought about Daiki-san and have always respected him. I would love to support him to have a great family. Ugh, I'll give you him so I don't care, though. You're boring and bland, so just stay in the shadows. It was time to choose between the two. You two understand why you were both called here? Yes, I do. The woman who is good enough for my brother Daiki. I'm going to be chosen, I know it. I hope I can go out with Daiki-kun. I came here to see the next wife of West Mountain Co. because I'm a big stakeholder, but... Tomoki-kun is actually an interesting fellow, isn't he? Daiki will be dating... Umika-san! Congratulations, and welcome to the family! Me? I don't believe it! Thank you! No way! No way! Oh, I see. I understand now. <laughs> Kokomi-san, who wasn't chosen, crept towards me with a creepy smile on her face. Tomoki-san, you fell for me while going on these dates with me, didn't you? That's why you chose Umika to go out with Daiki-kun. That way you can go out with me. I've actually fallen for you too, and I really like you. Please go out with me. This is perfect. It's all going so perfectly. It's scary. <laughs> what? No. I've always known it wouldn't be you from the moment I saw you at the sushi store. You probably haven't figured it out, but maybe you'll remember if I get changed into my regular clothes. I changed into my sweats and showed up. She lost all color in her face. Y you're that guy from the expensive sushi store. The sweater guy at the counter. Thanks for looking down on me and mocking me at the store. I didn't forget. I kind of left you at the end just to mess with you. <laughs> no, my money! <laughs> <laughs> wonderful. My brother was able to find a wonderful partner named Umika. Kokomi-san, well, she's not having a good time. That's what happens when you look down on people. What do you guys think about gold diggers? Did you feel good watching today's story? If you had a good time, go ahead and subscribe for more. Looking for more interesting stories and videos? Then come check out other videos from Mani Mani people here. We'd love to hear your thoughts too. Drop a line in the comments below. See you soon!